Hey, what's up guys in this video we are going to discuss about the rm remove right protected regular mt file error in linux and how to solve the message rm remove right protected regular mt file appears when you try to remove a right protected read only file using the rm command unix like operating systems like linux it is the system's way of asking you if you are sure you want to delete a file that has been marked at the read only let's reproduce the error <coughs> create a file and make it read only Next, remove the file using the rm command and see what happens. Linux terminal asks if you want to remove the right protected empty file. This is not error. Beginners to Linux may get confused with this message. Let's deep dive further and learn more about this error. rm remove right protected regular empty file and the solution. Here how you can handle this situation. First confirm deletion. You can simply type Y and press enter to confirm the deletion of the file or N to cancel when you get the message. Let's see how. Let's confirm the file if it's deleted or not using the ls command. I can see the file deleted now. Second, force deletion with dash F option. You can use the dash F option with RM to forcefully remove a file. This will not ask for confirmation and simply remove the file. Let's see. Note, Linux command by default do not provide feedback. If you do not get any error on the terminal, that means command execution is successful. You can also verify the file removal by using the ls command as shown in example 1. Third, change file permission using change mode. Now before removing the file, you can change its permission to make it writable. This way, when you use RM next, you won't get the prompt. Now remove the file. Just confirm file removal using the ls command. See, file got deleted. Check file ownership using ls. Now, sometimes the file might be owned by different users or system account. In such cases, you might need super user privilege to remove the file. Use ls-l file name option to check the ownership and permission of the file. If necessary, you can use the sudo to remove the file. Note, be careful when using a sudo as it grants elevated permission and you can accidentally cause damage to the system if you are not careful. Always remember to double check the file names and paths before executing the rm command especially with options like dash f or when using a sudo to avoid unintentional deletion of important files. Now, to conclude, encountering the message rm remove write protected regular empty file indicates that you are trying to delete a write protected file on a unix like system. While the system provides this prompt as a safeguard, you have the various methods at your disposal to proceed with the deletion.